Hi everyone, I'm Jane and today I'm going to show you a painting that you've been begging me for for a long time. For this painting, we're going to use the following colors. Yellow Oxide, Alizarin Crimson, Thalo Blue, and Titanium White. I'm going to use a one inch flat brush and a filbert brush. This one is about three quarters of an inch. I'm painting on an 8x10 canvas and you can paint it on any canvas you choose. We're going to start off by painting the background blue and that's just to give it an underpainting so we don't have to work so hard to cover all the white spots. So I'm going to use my one inch flat brush. I'm going to wet it in a jar and wipe it on the edge. And I'm just going to randomly cover it in a little bit of blue and a little bit of white. Notice I didn't worry about the brush directionality or how evenly it's covered. Now to get the really streaky background, like in the painting over here, I'm gonna use this filbert brush and I'm only going to use the edge. I'm not gonna use it flat at all. And so I dipped it in my water and then I'm really just shaking it out. I want my sky to be darker at the top because I want it to seem like there's storm clouds either blowing in or moving away. So I'm going to start with a little bit of blue, a little bit of red, and then I'm going to gray it down a bit by taking just a little hint of yellow, and then a little bit of white. Now I'm going to grab a little bit more white and start making some lighter areas. Now I'm going to start down in here and I'm going to just kind of go up in between my brush strokes here. I'm not really going to take it over top of it. And that's going to create a bit of a blend. Just keep adding colors until you like what you see. I'm gonna add quite a bit more white down here. All right, now we're gonna do our hill and I'm not washing off my brush. I'm just gonna grab some yellow because I want that to be the main color of my hill. Give it a little bit of a sandy quality, but because of the blue, white, and red that are still in my brush, I'm not gonna get that bright yellow. Okay, let's add our water. Still not cleaning off my brush, it's still a mess. I'm gonna get some more blue. I'm gonna mix it with a hint of the yellow. So it's got a little bit of a greenish feel to it. And a bit of white. All of these brush strokes here are gonna be horizontal. And there you have your super fast, but super impressive looking abstract landscape like the one behind me here. As always, I'm really looking forward to seeing what you guys do with this. Thanks for watching everyone and I'll see you next time.